there'll be a pathway. It's an unbelievable spot. Yeah, it is amazing, really. Could be our new home. Hey? <laughs> Could be our new home. Where are you gonna go? I'd just go where that marker is. the whole way here for 15 hours and we've possibly well not possibly nearly run out of fuel <laughs> so we're not going to be able to get back so I need to call the Coast Guard to come and bring us some but fortunately not much reception so we we'll venture up here and hopefully find some Tell you what, it's pretty worth. Well, it's a great place to be stranded. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So I'm looking forward to a swim once I do the hard yards. Alright, let's go. We've gone to the south end of Refuge Coven. Not any luck with reception. There's a few spots along here where it worked, but it's enough to make a phone call, which is not ideal, but I'm gonna try and go a bit further up from where our boat is and see if that works. It's all part of the journey, isn't it? It's not the destination, it's the journey. <laughs> Remind myself about that in, in a few days' time if this doesn't get a plan. <laughs> with a couple when I was walking to the campground and I just crossed past them again and they're like oh did you get frame reception I was like no we didn't and they were so lovely and I think this is what I'm going to learn if we're cruising a bit is that the cruising community are always going to be able to help you out and they said that there's possible they're in Rhapsody which is about down that end and they might be able to help us with some fuel or possibly phone reception he said that Port Welsh was about three and a half hours and he sort of said that they're probably not going to come to us but I think we'll be able to have to sway them because I don't think we're going to take the risk to get there. So yeah, if I can't get reception, I'm going to have to get in the dinghy and go and see them which is very um, comforting to know that people always willing to help out. I feel like that will always come back if you are willing to do the same. So I'm feeling a bit better. Positive vibes. <laughs>
Does anyone tell the story from this point? <laughs> so currently out in the middle of the opening to Refuge Cove to try and get phone reception, which we got. And we are currently waiting for a call back from the water police because they are trying to organise it for us. <laughs> so... I've never tried my horse. Yeah, it's looking promising. I feel confident. That's embarrassed. <laughs> Very embarrassed. Look, they could be coming now on the motorboat. Huh? They'll be quick. Imagine that. Of course, the Thunderbirds. FAB virtual. <laughs> There's definitely worse places to be stranded. I know, boats. <laughs> Always bring spare fuel. Learn the lesson. Nice anyway. view, though. Yeah, exactly. Charlie's left on the boat by himself. That could be an enemy. Yeah, swinging on the hammock, so it could very well break that. Anyway. Still got reception. Hold the phone up. No, you need to pop it back that way a little bit. Stay tuned. So, up, update. Yes, I will do that. Sit rep. Sit looks like we're BIT back in town. The uh, Chloe did well with the contact and communication to the Coast Guard. Couldn't get any reception. Everyone was very helpful in the bay. Yes. But we had to go and take the rib out to the centre, out the window. All the way out, out there to, to get the reception. Which the girl on Triple O was a little bit difficult to understand. A little rubber duck floating around and uh, we needed help. But in the but. end of the day, future reference, ring the phone number on the back of your maritime <laughs> license, ring triple O. That's only for emergencies. But yeah. as far as we're concerned, this is a it massive emergency. It was an emergency. emergency. They're also bringing the Uber Eats order that we placed at Welshpool. Not really. Uh, but they're going to be here at 2.30. Big so mistake. Two hours. A valuable lesson. But we, we've solved the problem. Mm. Hopefully the fuel's not in yet. But yeah, Chloe yeah. did really well. A team. Now time for a swim. Thank you. 